County officials say 17 roads are impacted right now, washed out or damaged by floodwaters, and it is still raining. Imagine looking down the deck of your condo to find your basement is now a pond. Your grill and everything in your yard is underwater. I've been around here a long time, but it's, it's bad. It's bad for the people across the street because they are definitely flooded out. Flooding took two buildings of the Canal Woods condominiums in Salisbury out of commission this week, forced several residents out of their homes and into shelters. Many here told us the flooding caught them off guard. And I seen these um, firemen standing there, and it kind of you know startled me, and I you know I didn't know what to ex what was going on. What Marie Jones says firefighters warned her about dangerous floodwaters in the middle of the night. They told me that I had to evacuate to get whatever I needed to, you know, to leave. And while the standing water in other parts of Salisbury was slowly receding hour by hour and folks were able to start cleaning up. As much as we can, you know, before more rain comes tomorrow. So, you know, before it gets out of hand, we got a lot of debris just kind of washed around from the, you know, all the neighboring college houses and stuff. It is not over yet. By Comico County emergency officials say the ground is already so saturated from rainfall, it can't absorb any more. Too much runoff with no place to run to. And unfortunately, officials say that means that some of the standing water will remain for at least another day or two. In Salisbury, I'm Kate Amara, WBAL TV 11 News.